If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. I post a new Tom Brady video every day. TB12 heat check. TB12 heat, heat check. check. Just like come if he's back doing that. right. Okay. Um, from a scale of zero to twelve. Okay. Let's okay. Let's see what you're doing. All right. Let's zero is doing jello shots at Rita Moreno's house. <laughs> like he's way out. Like he's not even. He's not even. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> he's not even contemplating the thought of returning. She's 90. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, he may be doing jello shots. Okay, so <laughs> it's doing jello shots at Rita Moreno's house. That's zero. And 12 is he's back. Back. Absolutely. Ah. That's the heat check. So where are we right now? Like a nine? Uh, no, no, no. No. I'm a, no, no, no. I got, we got a hedge. We got a hedge. We got a hedge. Right now it's so early. We're six. So we're right six. in the middle. Yeah. Uh, Six and a half is right in the middle, but Ooh. he kind of has six or seven. You know, seven is you're on the north side of leaning. He's carrying the water around. I'm, yeah. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Sleet and healthy. Uh, I'll go, no, I'll go seven. I'll go seven, seven right now. So you're, is that you too know, high to start? Is that too high to start? You're kind of nudging. Ian Rappaport, let's get to it right here. Right here on the Rich Eyes Show. The mother load quarterback story. Isn't Aaron Rodgers, believe it or not. It just isn't, even though he might get paid $50 million and he could wind up in Denver or whatever happens with the Packers. It's TB12, sir. It's TB12. Why? Yeah. What's with the door? What's the door still open? Like he goes on Fred Couples' podcast just as we get to, to Indianapolis, you know, talking oh, about Fred that he's going to get through a little more vacation time. That, that he's, he's sleeping in his old bed, you know, in his old house. And when he gets through all that, then he'll, he'll see where he's at, right? And and then Bruce Arians is it, it just, you know, even though I think that would probably be a, uh, a Glazer family decision if Brady says, I want out, I want to come back, but not with you. Or maybe he comes back with them. What is What is going on with Tom Brady? Dude. I never. First of all, he he has an opportunity to retire to his own podcast and passes up on it and Instagrams everything out. But he only retires to the Bucks. Right. Like he slipped his mind that the Patriots. And then today's today's date is. I'm a full fledged twelve. That's crazy. Well, um, there's two things that are going on. Okay. First of all, I would assume it sounds like. This is like so dumb, but this is the way somebody who knows Brady very well described it to me. I guess Brady walks around with a jug of water all the time, mm -hmm. right, to make sure that he's fully hydrated. Sure. And I made the joke to someone who knows him very well and has known him forever. I go, I guess we can retire the jug. And this person looked at me like I was crazy and was like, oh, no, he's still got the jug. Like, he's still in shape. He's still eating well. He's still doing the TB12 method or whatever. And he's still keeping himself hydrated in case. He's still doing all the things that he would do in case he wanted to return. You can't go 12 now. You can't just no, go 12 no, now. No, no. Sorry, 11.9. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know if he's going to come back. I know it is at least possible, and I don't know where the level of possible is, but it is at least possible. I also know that Larry Fitzgerald still has not retired, and even last year when it became clear that he was not going to play for the Arizona Cardinals, he still was like, yeah, we'll see. I'm not retired. Um, you know, uh, all of that. So, like, it's like these guys want to keep the door open. Hmm. You know, and maybe he's doing some of that, too. For what purpose? I, I mean, like, they announce he's he's – He's uh, running lines with Jane Fonda one second, and then the next minute he's got the jug of water and his avocado ice cream, and you know, and and he's still he's still sticking with the plant. Look, I, I didn't expect him to just suddenly just you know go get a bag of jelly beans and just veg out on the couch. But this sounds like he wants to still play. I'll be very honest with you. This is this is definitely somebody who sounds like he still wants to play. But you you know, Rich, you always hear the point. Zero. You always That's hear me. the retired players, and the one thing I hear yeah, constantly, and Chris, I know you hear it too, is the thing that they miss, that camaraderie, yeah. the locker room. If he's still Giselle's out there doing this in such a high, like, at a high level, why would you walk away right now? It just doesn't. Well, it's just, he also only knows one way to, you know, live and treat his body and everything like that. So I, I don't take it to mean that the reason why that he hasn't, you know, gotten a bag of jelly beans and and sat on the couch and Netflixed and did all yeah, that, that stuff. That would never happen, right? It, it's no. just that that's that's not his way of yeah. doing it. I'm not taking the fact that he's still doing TB12 that he's 
thinking of coming back, but his Ian saying somebody who knows him really well says that that is an indication to him. And Arians, his responses when asked about, you know, <laughs> about know. the possibility of letting him go play elsewhere, that, I mean, you could see that really got, I pissed him off. Like, you could see that. You could see I, that. I appreciate Bruce Arians Me too. so much. Right. Because it would be annoying if you, you know, you go all in, you get Brady, you win the Super Bowl, and then if he wants to play somewhere else, like, for BA to be like, no, you should play for us or no. Now, I will say this. I've seen all the rumors um, and the kind of reporting on Brady wanting to be in San Francisco, and I've seen, you know, Mike Corio has had some of that. I have not personally corroborated any of that. Now, maybe my sources are not as good. I just, I've had no one tell me that he actually wants to play for San Fran. Well, what about um, Tampa, though? I mean, because clearly we, we their their quarterback decision may be just, well, we got Gabbard. He knows the system. It's entirely possible that they might shock everybody and go back to Jameis, which, you know, would kind of be a, a bit of a surprise. But what if they just maintain the status quo and not suddenly it's June, could. you know, and then and then we, we give Tom a call and say, what do you think, you know? Yeah, I mean uh, – they, he would not be the first big time quarterback to decide right around June to start a training camp. Yeah, I think I'm just going to play. Um, the other thing is, you know, I would expect him to be looking around and taking a big swing elsewhere anyway. What's your heat check? What's your Brady heat check? <laughs> That's it for this video. I post a new Tom Brady video every day. So please like and subscribe. That way you'll always have a new Tom Brady video to watch every single day.